So I found this really good chart on the Federal Reserve website. This is MB, monetary base. It's the number of dollars ever created, the number of dollars that are in circulation. You'll notice pre-pandemic, we're at 3,200 or so billion dollars. Post-pandemic, it doubles. We're up around 6,000 and change billion dollars in circulation. And when you double the amount of money in the economy, all else being equal, the prices are gonna double. That's why I predict 100% inflation compared to 2019 numbers. That means $700,000 houses, $5 gas, groceries for a family of four for a week, it's about 300 bucks. The good news is we're kind of already there. Those numbers don't sound too foreign to a lot of us. The bad news is this line is still going up. Money supply is still increasing. There's a lot of complicated ideas out there about what causes inflation, but you can't ignore the fact that the money supply has, has doubled in the last few years. As the economy grows, it'll soak up some of this excess cash floating around. We might not see 100% inflation right away, but as with all financial predictions, if you wait long enough, eventually you're right. So there you go. That's my take. I hope that helps. Let me know what you think.